I'm Dr. Stephen Lemon, and I'm a medical oncologist with Oncology Associates in Omaha, Nebraska. In this video, I'm going to talk about a new drug for the treatment of advanced or metastatic breast cancer that is HER2 positive. The drug is called TDM1, also referred to as trastuzumab emtansine. Trastuzumab emtansine is a combination of an antibody with a drug that fights cancer cells. TDM1 is used in patients that are HER2 positive with their breast cancer. HER2 positive breast cancer accounts for about 20% of breast cancer cases. If a person is HER2 negative, then TDM1 is not an option for treatment for them. HER2 is a protein that is often found in breast cancer and in fact is overproduced in breast cancer. So the HER2 protein has a role in making breast cancer grow. So the drug trastuzumab, also called Herceptin, is an antibody that fights the HER2 protein and also can kill the breast cancer cell that has the HER2 protein. The exciting thing about TDM1 is that the Herceptin is combined with an additional drug that then gets taken into the cancer cell and is more effective in killing that cancer cell than Herceptin is by itself. So the nice part about TDM1 is that it targets the cancer cells, but not the normal cells. We get a better result with the drug and less side effects. TDM1 is used in patients who are HER2 positive and who have breast cancer that is not surgically resectable, meaning that it cannot be removed by surgery, or has spread to other places, called metastatic breast cancer. Right now, TDM1 is not available. The FDA is currently reviewing an application for the drug to be approved for general treatment. A study was just published in the journal, the New England Journal of Medicine, showing that TDM1 in HER2 positive advanced or metastatic breast cancer has very good survival. It has the best overall survival that has been seen for a drug of this type. This is very exciting information and a very promising drug.